two London sides with very proud traditions, albeit from different parts of the city. Huge supports around the world. Stay tuned, we'll bring you all the action live from Stamford Bridge as Chelsea face Spurs. Welcome to Stamford Bridge here in West London. And when you think of the Battle of the Bridge, you think of 2016 when Chelsea officially ended Spurs' title hopes with a 2-2 draw. Chelsea against Spurs today. Derek Ray alongside Stuart Robson here on the gantry. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing? Well, first of all, Derek, the atmosphere inside the stadium is incredible. And what a game we have in store for us. These two have become really fierce rivals in more recent times. And I think it's fair to say they don't like each other very much. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Kepa is the goalkeeper. Aspili Quetta starts with Marcos Alonso in the fullback positions. Jorginho plays with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Ben Davis starts alongside Davinson Sanchez in central defence. And in attack, Harry Kane starts together with Lucas. Thank you for attending Stamford Bridge. Enjoy the game. And this confrontation is underway. Kane. Just cutting off the supply. Marcos Alonso. On the ball, Rudiger. And Goro Conte. Now with Jorginho, happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Tremendous block, great block again. Favouring the short one. Conte. And Alonso. But he tried in vain to get himself back on side. Well, he needs to show greater awareness there and hold on to the ball a fraction longer. Jorginho Romelu Lukaku now Jorginho and he takes on the shot and the keeper showing tremendous command And how about the short corner? Conte. Now Lukaku. Now able to close down the short. Well, he likes to run at them. 
Reguilón. Lucas Mora. And lining it up. And a no nonsense clearance. Marcos Alonso. Pulisic. Corte. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Ngoro Conte. No nonsense clearance. Oliver skip. Oh, he's given it away. Ngoro Conte. Aspiliqueta. And possession given away. Reguilon. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Played here. And no luck keeping possession. And go to Conte. Romelu Lukaku now. Now they're sitting ever deeper. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Well, Spurs now in potentially a dangerous position. And let's give credit to the defending. Lukaku. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Perfect challenge. Well, it was a close call, but the fans are not happy with that decision. Playing with purpose and control. Rob them. Hudson Odoi. Now with Jorginho. Polisic. It's Callum Hudson Odoi. Crossing possibilities. Giving it a try. Able to get a body in the way. Oh, good use of the ball. Lukaku. You'll be hard pressed to find a better save than that. Loris. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Going short. Free kick to Chelsea. Well, he's certainly been warned, Stuart. No more challenges like that. Well, he's in no doubt now. He can't foul again. He's played it short here. Pulisic cuts it back. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Well, there it is. They're creating chances with some excellent attacking football, but the finishing just hasn't been good enough. They've been far too wasteful in front of goal. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Jorginho. Lukaku. It's with Hakim Ziyech. N'Golo Conte. Lukaku. Pass after pass. And it goes! Well, the pressure has been mounting, and now they have the lead! Well, here's the goal again, and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding. 
They're just waiting for the right time to penetrate. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. draws to a close here in West London I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far well he certainly had an impact on that first half scoring that late goal but I thought his overall contribution was really good and he got better as the half wore on advantage Chelsea after the first 45 minutes but a long way from being decided Thiago Silva Ziyech Conte has it Rudiger on to Jorginho Timo Werner It's with Hakim Ziyech. Options in the centre. It is now with Jorginho. They couldn't maintain possession. Davinson Sanchez. Rebier. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. And Spurs moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Good looking ball. Space and time for the cross. And they'll get ready for the throw in. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Steven Bergwijn and it's Winks and space for the cross he's blocked it well dealt with that ball comfortably and threading it forward oh a moment of pure class had to catch it perfectly and didn't he just Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1 1. Well, here it is again. He's alive to the situation. He makes good contact with the ball and he keeps it down. That's a nice headed goal. underway here how will Spurs reply to that setback
Ziyech. Now with Aspiliqueta. Jorginho. And still danger here. Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Crisp tackling. place to cut out the pass Pulisic now with Jorginho happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition Werner getting forward and options in the centre cutting the ball back and he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Davidson Sanchez. Applying vigorous pressure. And he takes it on. Superb block. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not the best clearance. Just ten minutes to go. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, it petered out. Ziyech. Intercepting it intelligently. How can they find a late leveller? This could be the equaliser. But no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And now the delivery. And well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Oh, great defending. Werner and Pulisic has it and offside it is and a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up And the referee has decided to add on a minimum of five minutes. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. And let's give credit to the defending. This is looking threatening. Marcos Alonso. Mount. Can he find the net? And the keeper diving to thwart him. If they can score again from this corner... It probably would be the end of the story. <laughs> 
trying to deliver it accurately a Spurs free kick it's going to be So the final whistle, and what we can say officially now is that Chelsea have picked up maximum points from this fixture. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory. Well, Christian Pulisic is no stranger to attention from our cameras. And as you can see, they're following him around on the back of an exceptional performance, Stuart. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.